Bridgeport police officer who accidentally shot himself in the leg in a bagel shop is now facing criminal charges for what happened that day. Well, it actually happened back in December, but now state police have arrested that Bridgeport cop. News 8's Aaron Logan is live tonight in our New Haven newsroom with the very latest. Aaron? And Darren, the 28-year veteran police officer did turn himself in. State police have been investigating this case involving 50-year-old Juan Santiago. There was a lot of frustration since the initial incident on December 17th, even a protest saying Officer Santiago was being given special treatment. Outside the police station and inside Bagel King, people in Bridgeport had one man on their mind for weeks. Officer Juan Santiago, a 28-year veteran. I thought it was going to be some kind of cover-up, maybe, like, I don't know, a cop. They don't want to arrest their own kind, right? <laughs> Frank Barardo stops in Bagel King regularly and says people have been wondering what would happen to Santiago after the December 17th incident when Santiago shot himself in the leg by accident in the bagel shop filled with customers. He reportedly pulled the trigger while pointing it at the floor, not knowing it was loaded. Since then, he's been on paid administrative leave. We went to Santiago's Bridgeport home to get a comment about his arrest almost two months later. His dog was barking loud and jumping. No one answered. As soon as we left, we noticed someone inside pulled the blinds. One of the Bagel King's co-owners says he's not surprised people took their concerns to the streets in the beginning. I don't think people made a bigger deal. Um, my personal opinion is if nobody was hurt, I think it's a learning experience and I don't think anyone should be charged. But uh, officers and uh, civilians should be treated equally in the law and um, other civilians would be arrested on the spot. Now I spoke to Santiago's lawyer, John Goulash. He would not comment on the case. State police would not either. Officer Santiago was charged with unlawful discharge of a firearm and will be in court on February 18th. Live in the New Haven newsroom, Aaron Logan, back to you in the studio.